Hi, I hope you're doing well today. I'm Winnie, and today I will show you how to generate a DHL label from a sale that you've made on your Africrea shop. This is your homepage that you will get when you want to manage all of your different services and account. When it comes to your sales, when you want to see what the a recap of all of your current sales, you can just go to sale, sales. Here, you have all of the recaps of all of your current sales and, and the ones that are finished, the ones that need to be accepted and the ones that need to be shipped. Let's take, for example, this one that needs to be shipped. So as you can see here, everything has already been done. The order has been has come in, but now it needs to be shipped. So you click on ship it. And you can either choose not to go through our DHL service. And if that is the case, you click on no thanks. I will ship my order with another method. That way you can ship your item by using any other transporter or logistic service that you would like. But if you do decide to use our DHL service, it is also very simple. You simply need to go through here, continue go down basically and continue to fill out the forms here you have it is automatically entered your uh, it has automatically entered your different information shipping information and phone number if this is not the case you can change them change it by clicking on edit if this is correct then you move on to the to the recipient so your client's address so you enter all of the different information, the phone number and all that, the address and the zip code, the city and the details on the package itself. You can either choose to send a flyer or you can choose to send a box. When you choose the flyer, the width, length and height of the item are already pre-filled and you simply need to add the weight. But if you choose a box, then you have to write in the details and dimensions of the actual box. And you, you add the weight and it will give you an approximative uh, price for this item. If all of it is correct, once again, you proceed to customs. When it comes to customs, you must also have a declared price for your item so you must write the actual value of the item that you're selling and then you can when it comes to the customs you must simply add the declared price the declared value of your item make sure to add the correct value and not a, a reduced value then you have to add the package content. You must be as specific, as specific as possible when you're adding your package content. If you need help with adding your package content, you can simply click here to have more details from our help center. You will have this article here that is available to you. To continue, once everything has been entered here, you come here and it will, it will still give you the same price for the item. Then you proceed to payment. And now you can choose the, me the payment method that you would prefer. You can use your wallet where you already have money. You can use a card. You can use your PayPal account. You can use M-Pesa if you're a Kenyan um, seller, or you can use Naira bank account if you're a Nigerian seller, and you can have you can use any other card if you wish to. Here we can just go simply with the wallet because it's just simpler. And you press, you click on play, uh, you click on pay. Sorry. There you go. You can confirm you have you can confirm to your client that you have shipped their item and they'll receive a notification letting them know that the item has been shipped with the different details from um, for tracking. You can personalize a message to them and let them know or you can use to let them know or you can use a common reply to let them know as well. 
that's it that's all you're gonna need and you just confirm shipping and your item has officially been shipped so now to track your package you simply need to click here track my package and the client can also track their package because you've gone through dhl with us that's it for how to ship an item from a sale that you've made on your Africrea shop. If you have any questions, feel free to ask us, send us a message, send us an email on yesweCare at africrea.com and, and our customer service team will be happy to answer your questions. In the meantime, I'm gonna wish you a good day and um, I, will, I will see you very soon. <laughs> Bye.